Good afternoon and welcome back to Paul Sherry Conversion Vans. My name is Justin Smith and today we're going to do another new video on a new arrival here at the dealership. What we're looking at is the all new 2015 Sherry Ram ProMaster Conversion Van. Now this particular van is a seven passenger conversion van built on the 136 inch wheelbase and is a low top. Stock number on this unit is 27393. Exterior color in this van is what they call deep cherry red pearl coat. It really pops when the sun's hitting it. You can see all the metallic in it. It's a beautiful color. And just like all the other ProMasters that we do here at the dealership, this one does have full body paint. Uh, front face has been painted to match. Power mirrors on both sides have been painted to match. Door handles, fender trim, and of course the ground effects. Now this particular van does feature the 18 inch wheel package. We do have privacy glass on the front two doors. It's a 35% to stay compliant in all 50 states. Moving along to the back of the van, you notice the back glass is a lot darker. That is a factory 5% limo tent glass. Moving around the back, I want to take this time to go over some important safety features, starting with the backup camera that is located dead center top of the van. Now with this backup camera, anytime you put this vehicle in reverse, you're going to get a nice visual of whatever might be behind you to right on your navigation screen. It's a great safety feature. Also this van does come with traction control, anti-lock brakes, hill start brake assist, and rollover mitigation system. Now if you have any questions or need more detail on those safety features, uh, my name is Justin. You can call me and I'll be able to go over those with better detail. Moving along to the passenger side of the van, I want to take this time to demonstrate the entry and exit on this conversion van. And again, being a low top conversion van, um, you know, you, a lot of you out there wonder how much room's in the back of this van. Well, with having the lowest floor in the, in the industry of only 21 inches off the ground, because of our front wheel drive platform, it allows us to have a lower floor because we don't have a drive shaft going to the rear axles. Now this low top conversion van has a roof height of seven foot five, but I am six foot two and can stand up in this van. I do have to slouch over a little bit, um, but about the same room you'd find in any GM high top is in our low top. We do have nice storage compartments all the way around. The only low top conversion van to carry the overhead storage, just like all of our raised roofs. We do have the real pretty indirect lighting all along the top of the roof. And of course, down the midway point of the wall as well. Now all of our vans do feature privacy shades. to give you a little more protection from the sun or a little more privacy. And they are all back behind this recessed wall. I think they turned out really good. Now the interior in this van is a light gray. Well, I'm sorry, a dark gray with light gray inserts. I apologize. Captain's chairs, same way. And they are on a swivel base and do feature power recline. Now the entertainment in the back of this van features a rear radio, AM FM tuner, CD player, does uh, have the capability to answer hands-free phone calls. And below the rear radio is your control panel. The four toggle switches are gonna control your indirect lighting, uh, map light in the back of this van. Now you'll notice it does have a 110 plug-in, also does have a DC port as well and an HDMI input. So whatever you plug into that HDMI input is going to display on the 20 inch flip down screen that we have in this low top van. Um, this setup is ideal for video games, um, transferring movies from a laptop. Um, again, anything that uses an HDMI, you can connect directly to the flip down entertainment. 
Though this van does feature the Pro Air 2 system, which is a digital thermostat. Very easy system to operate. One touch, set, and forget. Here is the flip down in this van. And it is connected to the Blu-ray player via HDMI cable. So even being a flip down, it does still give you a 1080p picture. Now that flip down is paired up to this LG Smart Blu-ray player. Now the Blu-ray player does have Netflix and uh, Pandora, Hulu, and a few other um, widgets for me to choose from. Um, very nice feature to have. And uh, with a Wi-Fi hotspot, you can watch Netflix going right down the road. Moving to the front of this van, you notice the front two captain chairs display the same leather that's in the back of the van. Now these chairs are on an eight-way adjustable pedestal with lumbar recline and heat. Steering wheel in this van is a nice leather wrapped wheel with steering wheel controls on both sides of the airbag that are going to operate your navigation radio. Uh, give you the ability to answer hands-free calls while in motion. Now, of course, this van does feature all the power components you would find or expect to find in any modern-day vehicle, such as power windows, power locks, keyless entry, uh, power folding mirrors, telescopic steering. So it's got all the goodies. As I mentioned on the back of the van, when we were talking about the rear backup camera, um, this does have a factory navigation system. It is a 5.0 Uconnect AM FM tuner with a CD player. And the navigation interface is a TomTom. -tom. So a lot of you are already familiar with how that works and uh, probably the easiest factory navigation I've ever had a chance to play with. So won't have an, uh, any problems. It won't take you six months to learn this one. <laughs> Air controls and the heat controls for the front of the van are located right below the radio. Three rotary dials. As far as charging goes up in the front of this van, we do have two USB ports and a DC port to handle all your charging needs. We also have six cup holders in the front of this van. Three directly below the radio, one on the dash and one in each door panel. And storage in the front of this van has a nice little uh, storage slot. Do have a gov uh, two glove boxes, one down here at the bottom and then one up on top of the dash that opens as well. And that pretty much wraps up the inside and the outside of this new 2015 Sherry Ram Promaster low top conversion van. Now if you have any questions on this particular van or maybe a different van that you've seen on our website, Please do not hesitate to call. My name is Justin, and I'm always willing and always around, ready to answer anybody's questions. Thanks, and have a great day.